In this video we are going to see method statement for installation of fans in HVAC systems. Welcome to Controls and Systems YouTube channel. Scope and Purpose This method statement covers the on-site installation of fans and the requirements of checks to be carried out. Reference Documents Project Specifications Approved Shop Drawings Latest Revision Approved Material Submittals General Fans generally are installed in locations shown in drawings. Types of fans used and mainly classified as Toilet extract fans, kitchen extract fans, refuse fan, lobby pressure relief fans, stairwell pressurization fans, car park exhaust fans, jet fans etc. Equipment, drilling machine, spirit level, lifting equipments, scaffolding, hand tools of tradesmen, responsible personnel, project engineers, construction and charge, site engineer and site supervisor, QA and QC inspectors, safety officer, site foreman, pipe fitters, helpers. Method of PRE installation, ensure that approved material required to carry out work will be available. Check the name plate details of fans as per approved shop, drawing, schedules and material submittals before installation, prior to commencement of work. Area and access will be inspected to confirm that the site is ready to commence the work. All relevant documentation and material applicable to particular section of works will be checked by site engineer before commencement. Physical verification of material will be carried out for any damages prior to taking from stores. The site engineer or supervisor will give necessary instruction to tradesmen and provide necessary construction or shop drawings. The site engineer or supervisor will also check that tools and equipments available are in compliance to contract requirements. The site supervisor also explains tradesmen regarding safety precautions to be observed. Method of installation 1. Prior to commencement of work coordination will be done with other services. 2. Make sure that fans are free from damage and all internal components are complete and in good condition. 3. Fan assemblies will be transported to the nearest point of erection. Care will be taken while handling the units to avoid damage. Distortion. 4. Manufacturer's recommendation will be followed for installation of fans. 5. Fans will be installed in location as per approved shop drawing. Installation of floor mounted fans. 1. Ensure that builder's work foundation is provided as per approved shop drawing. 2. Ensure the level of founded ion by spirit level. 3. Check the size and orientation of foundation for its suitability to install the fans. 4. Fix the vibration isolators to foundation as per approved submittal. 5. Install the fan assembly mounting brackets on vibration isolators as per manufacturer's recommendations. 6. Complete the ductwork and damper installation as per approved shop drawing. Installation of inline mounted fans. 1. Fans can be mounted either horizontally or vertically as per approved shop drawing. 2. Support the fans by using threaded rods to the fan casing as per manufacturer's recommendations. 3. Provide vibration isolators, approved type, as per manufacturer's recommendations on the mounting brackets and holes. 4. Complete the ductwork and damper connection as per approved shop drawing. 5. Ensure that sufficient space is available to allow removal of access covers and subsequent removal of FN and motor assemblies etc. as per manufacturer's recommendations. 6. Complete all electrical connections as per approved electrical drawing and manufacturer's terminal diagram. 7. Earthing shall be provided as per requirements. 8. Complete the labeling of electrical connections as per schematic drawings. 9. Fan rotation shall be checked before duct connection. Quality control. OCE along with project engineer and site supervisor will monitor that all components are installed as per the contract specifications and approved submittals. Inspection request, IR, shall be submitted to the main contractor or consultant. Safety. Work will commence as per safety regulations laid down in the contract specification and project safety plan. Proper safety harness to be used and secured, if required. All personal protective equipment shall be used as appropriate according to the nature of job. Housekeeping shall be of good standard and all cut lengths and debris shall be removed. All lifting operations shall be monitored by safety officer. 
Thank you for watching our video. We will meet in, in another good video. Have a great day.